Welcome, my wonderful viewers. I am the audiophile barista. Normally, this is the opening for a vlog, but today I just want to give you a quick update. Where have I been? Because I haven't been posting for a few weeks and I haven't been reacting to your comments for a few weeks. And it's just like every now and then life gets in the way. And also another important thing during COVID, my amount of work I'm self-employed, the amount of work was going down and it's picking up now, but it's also very important that I put a lot of time and effort in that because I need to keep paying the rent and buy all new stuff for you to show. So that had my attention and a little bit less attention for the channel, but I'm not gone. That's what this video is about. So let's give you a little update of what is going on and what is going to come. As you know, I have these drawings. These are drawings from the actual equipment, coffee equipment that I have in my home. Here's another one. I like these, I think they are beautiful. This is number three. By the way, I'm almost at 4,000. So if you haven't subscribed yet, help me out. Get me to four as soon as possible. Now tomorrow, the artist that did those drawings is coming here and we're going to see if we can make the same drawing from my wonderful Rocket Espresso machine. This is a challenge because, as you can see, it's more or less one big mirror. So we're going to decide from what angle are we going to capture it and she will make a wonderful drawing from that also so i'm looking forward to that another thing that still needs to be done is to fix my 78 record machine this one is 100 years old and it won't crank anymore it's stuck somehow so this needs to be fixed fixed but i haven't got the time and i still love this thing for those who haven't seen over here is the horn that gives you more or less volume but normally you see these things with a big horn on top of it this one is inside another thing is this system you know every now and then i think why am i using tubes over here we have the preamp tube preamp that's giving tube problems the audio note gave me some tube problems and the audion is having some tube problems so why am i using tubes but then when i go solid state with the neumann or with the lin or the rega or the quad that i have it's obvious you know it just sounds better especially on loudspeakers like this so i ordered a tube i think there's one tube that is wrong and i ordered one i i've been waiting for a few weeks now and i checked this this morning i checked the order and it was cancelled somehow so i have to redo that this one came in the box with four extra tubes so i only had to replace one so this one is working perfect completely silent again and this one is doing something strange when it is on for maybe an hour or something and you lightly touch the tubes it will make a loud glassy sound in the loudspeakers and it is on all four tubes and i don't know why it is it wasn't there before so that's another thing that i have to check out so one video that is coming up is I had some uh, buyers for this thing and they also stopped reacting. I don't know what's going on. Probably still the pandemic is making people cautious with spending money. Anyways, this thing has four inputs. So what I did as an experiment, because I wanted to try if everything is working, that's what I like to do when I sell something. So I put a CD player on it and then I thought, well, I have multiple CD players. I have, of course, the Audiolab. I have the uh, Rega CD player. I have still an Arcom CD player. So I connected all four of them, did some listening tests using the same CD, because I have multiple copies of this one, using the same CDs in all four 
CD players and listening to the difference. That's interesting. That has been filmed. That will come out. Yeah, over here you see all the cabling, which for all four CD players I used the same interconnects. Another thing that's almost coming up is this thing. You know, the little Kev egg shell loudspeakers that I have that is going to a friend, which by the way is the same friend that is doing the picturing the drawing for the espresso machine but she was rebuilding her house and she is almost done so the moment to install the lin and the kev loudspeakers is almost there and i will be filming all of that and showing it to you okay so that was my short update just sharing with you why i haven't been in the air for some time but i'm not gone I've never forgotten about you guys. I have a lot of ideas still. I just need the time to do all those things. And when life and work gets in the way, those things take priority, unfortunately. Anyways, I hope you like this little update. Glad to still have you here. If you haven't subscribed yet, help me out. Let me, let's get me to 4,000 subscribers and I will see you in the next one.